Hello everyone, today we are going to talk about area. Make sure to press the subscribe button for more videos. In this video, we will discuss what area is and I will provide a few examples. So what is area? Area is the total space taken up on a two-dimensional surface or shape. Within the boundary of a shape, the total space that is taken up is the area. When we find area, we use units squared. This means that the units that describe the area have a little two on the upper corner. For example, if I wanted to write down an area as 120 centimeters squared, I would write 120 centimeters squared. If I wanted to write down an area as 30 feet squared, I would write 30 feet squared. There are a few ways that we can find the area of a shape, and it depends on the problem and the shape that we are given. Let's say that I had this shape right here. As you can see, this shape is made up of many squares. One way to find the area of this shape is to find the number of squares in the shape. The unit of measurement that we'll be using is in meters. Let's count up the squares. I can see that there are 16 total squares in the shape. So the area is 16 meters squared. Let's try this next one. Pause the video to answer with your class. As you can see, the unit of measurement that we will be using will be feet. Again, to find the area, just count the squares. From counting, we have a total of 13 squares. So the area of this shape is 13 feet squared. Let's talk about the other way to find the area of a shape. Sometimes when we are given a shape, we are not given squares inside of the shape to count up, but we are given the length of the sides. For shapes like rectangles or squares, to find the area, we will multiply the length times the width, which are the two sides that we are given. The formula for the area of a rectangle is length times width. The same idea applies to the formula of a square. But because all sides of a square are equal, then we can say that the area of the square is side times side. So we will use these formulas. Let's try this example. The shape appears to be a rectangle and we have two side lengths that are given to us. One side measures five centimeters and the other side measures three centimeters. We can find the area by using our formula length times width. The length is five centimeters and the width is three centimeters. So five times three is 15. So the area of the shape is 15 centimeters squared. Okay, let's do one more example. Pause the video now to answer with your class. This shape looks like a square and I am certain that it's a square because the side lengths that we are given are also equal. We will use the formula side times side to find our area. Both sides are 10 meters long, so let's multiply them together. We have 10 times 10. 10 times 10 is equal to 100, so we have 100 meters squared. For more resources, you can access the Literacy and Math Ideas store. The link to the site will be in the description of this video.